Mm. Are you ready to not go to bed tonight? Yes, ma'am. Good. Be sure your sister's ready to not go to bed, too. Okay, ma'am. <clears throat> Leona! Leona! Wow! You, what you? Uh, you what, uh, Leona! Oh, boy, I am getting so good at pouncing. And you know what? You're getting very good at being pounced on. We don't have time for this. We have to get ready not to go to bed. I know, I know. I'm so excited. I even wrote a poem about it. Here. Read this. Meat shower by Fiona. Meat shower? It's not meat shower. <laughs> Oh it's meteor shower. Well, how about mommy and daddy said it was a meat shower? <laughs> this is a disappointment. I don't think I'll ever get over. Okay, I'm over it. But 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 but, but, but there's meat. Meteors are made of meat, right? Mm, mm. They're just like stars, you know. Only they shoot across the sky like fireworks. Late tonight, they're gonna shoot out of a lion in the sky. Wow. Hey, huh? check this out. Ooh. The Night of the Shooting Stars by Arliss Parknark. <laughs> read it, Lionel, read it. Oh, I wanna read this. The Mighty Star Lion who lifts in the sky, sends a meteor storm into flight. The meteors flash in a fiery dance that parts the deep darkness of night. Like star after star after sparkling star, shedding beautiful showers of light. And one little lion looks up at the sky and welcomes the marvelous sight. Like dream after dream after silvery dream, the starry light shower falls bright. And one little lion looks up at the sky as she sits all alone in the night. Then one, and then two, and then three lions more softly steal in from left and from right. Four sleepy lions all bathe in the glow of the magical meteor's light. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, it's great! Okay, Cubs, who's ready not to go to bed? Oh! Mm -hmm. I am. I am. Yeah, well, now, this isn't going to be easy. Lions need a good, solid 22 hours of sleep a day. Ah, uh, don't worry, Dad. We can handle it, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I know you can handle it. I'm worried about us. Uh, those lions will never stay up, and that little cub will miss the media shower. He cares. I do not care. I was merely stating a fact. Oh, he, he cares. <laughs> no, I don't. Star. Ah. You know, I just love that AR sound. Honey, it sounds so marvelous. Listen to me while I sing about it.
Come on. Bark. 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 Damn boy. Bark. Number 2612, Cliffhanger and the Wish Upon a Star. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, night falls. Far, far above, the first star appears. Sharp as attack, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. When you see a star, make a wish. Starlight, star bright, first star I see tonight, get me off this cliff. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. Excuse me. Yes. Would you folks mind rescuing me? Can all be well thanks to Cliff's wistful wish? That's easy for you to say. No, it is only a dream. A dream? <laughs> And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! that book you wrote. Yeah, yeah. Huh? Dad, what? Dad, what? Dad, oh, Dad. my little Leona wrote a book? Yeah, Ooh. yeah, yeah, see? Meat Shower by Leona. Whoa, oh, Meat Shower? shower? Yummy! Oh, 
did the trick. We're all still awake. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> still awake. You're, you're yeah. Just, hey. We're all awake. Okay, yeah. No sleeping. You're gonna miss the. You're gonna miss the the, the meteor. <laughs> meteor shower. <laughs> In armor will charge together at high speed and make a word. Competing today, we have Sir. <laughs> and on your right, Sir Ark. Ark. Brenda did. Ark. 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 Shark. 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 Excellent. Gawain's word for today. And this is Gawain saying, mark my words. I'll see you next time on... Gawain's word, Gawain's word. Shark. Ark. Park. Part. Park. What? What is it that has given you such a fright? Oh, Dwight, it's night, and that gives me fright. At night, there's no light to brighten up my sight. So, Dwight, if it's all right, please give me a night light. But there's no need for fright, because... There's no need to light a night light on a light night like tonight. For a night light's lights a slight light, and tonight's a night that's bright. No frights in sight, no sights of fright, and the light at this sight's quite bright. And so there's no need to light a night light quite slight on a quite quite bright night light tonight. Yes, yes quite, yes, yes quite. quite. Hold tight. Hold tight, because now we've got it right. And there's no need to light a night light on a light light like tonight. For a night light's light, a slight light, and tonight's a night that's bright. No frights in sight, no sights of bright, and tonight's light's 
of sight It's quite bright and quite bright So we've no need to light A night like tonight Cause tonight's a light night that's bright Now, fun with Chicken Jane. Today, Chicken Jane and the Fat Cat. Look, look, see, see, coming down the lane. Here comes Scott, here comes Dot, here comes Chicken Jane. Look, Scott, look at that. I see a cat. Yes, Dot, I see the cat. The cat is fat. Look, Scott, look. That fat cat is an acrobat. Look, Dot, look. See Chicken Jane write the letters S C A T. Cat, scat, scat. Scott, Scott, Scott. Scat, Dot, scat. Look at that. The fat cat went splat. Chicken Jane is flat. Yes, Chicken Jane is flat. We are not flat. <laughs> Thank you, Chicken Jane. Cat. P Pat. R part. K park. Sh shark. And now the shark barks. Bark, bark! Bark! Uh, well, uh, it's a living. And now, once again, it's time for the adventures of Sam Spud, our boiled potato detective. The name is Spud. Sam Spud. I was working late one night. The neon sign outside my window was blinking bright, dark, bright, dark. It was about to drive me crazy when there was a knock at my door. The guy was a mess. His face looked like raw humbarger. Humbarger? That's not right. Not humbarger. That U in hum should be an A, H, A, M, ham. And that A in barger should be a U, B, U, R, G, E, R, burger. His face looked like raw hamburger, as a matter of fact. It was raw hamburger. I could tell right away I was going to have to grill him. <laughs> the guy thanked me, threw some lettuce on my desk, and told me the rest would be gravy. Yeah. Mom! There's a talking potato on a stick with a hat on and no mouth! Don't worry, sweetie. It's educational television. It must be good for you. And now, a word from world-renowned mezzo-soprano, Ms. Denise Graves. The.
If someone doesn't wake them up, they're going to miss the media shower. Oh, Ooh. so you want us to, uh... Uh, you wake them up? I didn't say that. Oh, okay, then we won't. You won't? Okay, we're going. All right. <sighs> Pigeons, you have to tell them a hundred times before they'll do something. <sighs> The meteor shower! The meteor shower! Look! It's starting! The mighty star lion who lives in the sky sends a meteor storm into flight. The meteors flash in a fiery dance that parts the deep darkness of night. Like star after star after sparkling star Shedding beautiful showers of light And one little lion looks up at the sky And welcomes the marvelous sight Like dream after dream after silvery dream The starry like shower falls bright And one little lion looks up at the sky as she sits all alone in the night. Then one and then two and then three lions more softly stealing from left and from right. And four sleepy lions all bathe in the glow of the magical meteor's light. I want you to know that I had nothing to do with that cute little cub seeing the meteor shower. I do not take any credit for it. In spite of the fact that someone might want to give me credit, even a small award, maybe a cookie. There are games and stories at the Between the Lions website, bbskids.org or America Online, keyword PBS Kids. Reading to children every day creates warm family memories, and it helps them become better readers. Help a child get wild about reading. Be a designated reader. I'm Ooh. ready to get wild. Okay.